Hello and welcome back to this playthrough of H1 this free. Sorry about that. Um Let's take that. Uh, I wonder if I can take that. I didn't I think it was legendary difficulty, so maybe not. Okay. Okay, at least one. Let's heal you up. Bad will not stand, but it's not the end of the world. that should build a mercenary as well This is super weird. Why does government governance work in this campaign but not in the other two? Three, I mean. Wonder if it's a bug. That's weird. Uh, manual. Never out to resolve because the AI is shite. Well, it looks like it's Christmas. Can I want to get in some XP from a hero? <coughs> Here, ah. ping 
penguins can swim, so let's not get too close. Can I turn? Renomate ruins. Okay, no. I was thinking about. Ah, it's it's a water nod. Not. What you call it? Really good. Let's get that first though. Uh, it's a water nod, not a mana nod. <coughs> oh, greetings, Arvik of Clan Varm Varenhel. My name is Rollar, and I am here to warn your people that tig Tigrans of the cult of Yaka are invading Briska. I believe they intend to use it as a strength standing ground from attacking and melting this frozen realm. You are a Tigran. It has been long time since we have heard of your race. Why do you betray your own people for us frost for us frostlings? And why come to me? You should present your information to our High Queen. I have already spoken to her. She has sent out scouts to verify my reports. I am to serve you <coughs> in battle while we wait for them to return. My reasons for doing this are my own. She sent you? Then you must be spying for her. Or maybe this means I have her, sport, her support in the fight. I certainly hope so. And you, a man of nature, do you not object to s serve a necromancer? Death is a much part of nature as life, and I have sworn to serve Queen Shanhild. As long as you serve her, I shall serve you. Well, you can be sure of my loyalty to Shanhild. Come, let's depart. <sighs> kind of sucks I didn't know about that or remember that because then I would have wait and attack in. I, sh I would have waited and not picked up the level up thingy. Temple Master, guild plus great Temple Master. Uh, let's get that. What are we building here? Search complete. Let's get one more. Nice. Uh, go up this way. Need to start building units, I think. <coughs> Actually, get ready with that. That's ready. Oh, clear, clear skies to you, Lord. Forgive us for hunting your mammoths. We have to feed our people. Are you rebuilding the clan? Would you be willing to offer us a, a home? We will fight for you, and our people will work in your cities. You must know the population. Of dead cities, dead cities will not grow without effort. You must build unique city upgrades, like the harvesters guild in your dead cities, to make them grow. Additionally, when you win a battle, the bodies of those who have fallen will be taken to your cities to serve your empire as citizens. If you are lucky, you will find willing souls we can easily transform. Like the rabble in these tents. To transform living warriors into ghouls, you either need to become a harbinger of death, the secret of, of which I will reveal to you later, or order them to drink from a well of souls. One of those is close to your capital. Drink from the well, the well heals the undead 
and transforms the living into obedient ghouls. Sounds good. <laughs> Sounds good. Sounds pretty okay. <laughs> happens if the hero drinks? I don't think he will turn right or she. Is it he or she? Looks like a him. Uh, but we got to end this part here. Uh, thank you for watching and I hope I see you next time.